The inaugural Caroline Cooler Cup was held at Caroline Gardens, South Yarra, where the local Arcadians would take on the Frankston Dees and the St Kilda Isotopes in a round-robin football tournament. The Arcadians were led by West Australian goalkeeping hero Andrew Van Leeuwen. Brit Mike Oliver was an unknown but exciting inclusion in his squad, while Matt Howarth would offer the team stability and consistency in the midfield. Brit Tom Shaw would prove hard for the opposition to contain, and he ensured the locals entered as the tournament favourites. The Dees travel from the south, led by Hampton Street captain Grant Rowley, but his team would be rank outsiders. The much-loved Stefan Bartholomeus had only a single game of footy under his belt, while acting goalkeeper Mark Walker was put into a position most thought he couldn't handle. Youngster Tim Gibson played beyond his years to give the Dees a fighting chance. For the St Kilda Isotopes, captain Mitchell Adam hoped experience would pay dividends. He enlisted long-time Hampton Street player Phil Marney, joined by one of Hampton's original stars, Pat Howarth. Frenchman Cedric Dufour gave the Topes a squad that, on paper, looked a match for any. The very first game of the Cooler Cup was played between the Arcadians and the Isotopes. Here are some of the highlights. Can I zoom in? Acadians. Oh, there's one on the screen. Yeah. Oh. Hey. Oh, 
That could be it. That could nice be work, it. Maddie. 545, 5-0. Straight to him. So the Arcadians thrash the Isotopes 5-0 with Shaw and Oliver taking two goals each. While the Isotopes licked their wounds, the Arcadians remained on the pitch to play the Ds who did their best to offer the Arcadians a challenge. Decisions count when yeah, you have when to yell good. something. The Dees tried hard but were no match for the Arcadians. Tom Shaw kicked a staggering four goals to take his tournament total to six. 
The final game of the round robin was between the Ds and the Isotopes. With the Arcadians already safely into the grand final, the Ds and the Topes were playing for a place in the big one. The Topes squandered a two-goal lead to be overhauled by the Ds in a classic game. The win saw the Ds advance at the grand final against a confident Arcadian squad, but the men from Frankston would prove a hard team to contain.
Despite the camera malfunction, the Arcadians overcame a scare from the D's to win the inaugural Caroline Cooler Cup. Tom Shaw kicked a tournament high nine goals to win the Golden Boot, and here he is celebrating with his teammates Andrew Van Leeuwen, Matt Howarth, and Mike Oliver. So, the Arcadians are the champs, and we hope to see you all next year when the South Yarra team tries to defend its title.